guys on Ghana Talks Radio. I'm Deborah Dorso. Coming up, John Jinapo alleged there's an attempt to short Baumia over PDS scandal. Senior Staff Association of University of Ghana threatens not to call off their strike until they are fully paid. Four prices projected to drop for the fourth consecutive time. There's a growing call for Vice President Dr. Mahamudu Baumia to be investigated over his alleged involvement in a butchered power distribution services deal. Three citizens have already petitioned the Office of the Special Prosecutor to probe Baumia's role in the scandal. This development comes after John Jinapur tweeted there is an attempt to shoot Baumia from the scandal. The PDS scandal has been a contentious issue with many calling for accountability and transparency in the government's handling of the deal. Away from that, the Senior Staff Association of University of Ghana has declared a total nationwide strike today, September 16th, due to the government's failure to address their demands for improved working conditions. The association is protesting the government's inability to fulfill previous agreements, including the implementation of new rates for vehicle maintenance and related allowances, as well as the tier 2 deductions to fund managers since January 2024. National Chairman George Song has emphasized the strike will not be called off until their demands are met. <laughs> Because it is your future, it is your life. You mean your bank? Yeah, you decide. Final decision, and it says, and the star by the case candidate. We are not going because you can't say, you can't talk about any other than it. You want to be a human being, you can't be a human being. Moving on, four prices in Ghana is expected to drop for the fourth consecutive time. Starting today, according to the Chamber of Petroleum Consumers, COPEC, prices for petrol, diesel, and LPG would decrease by approximately 4%. This reduction is largely due to the decline in global petroleum prices. The decrease is to provide some relief to consumers amidst the ongoing fluctuation in global petroleum prices. However, it's essential to know those prices are subject to change if there are significant shifts in global market trends. This decreases to provide some relief to consumers amidst the ongoing fluctuation in global petroleum prices. However, it's essential to know those prices are subject to change if there are significant shifts in global market trends. They are now procuring crude $40 million every month. That translates to $480 million a year. That money can build a second gas processing plant. We cannot continue on this trajectory. And certainly, we cannot leave this in the hands of the people who cause a mess. There's an attempt to shield the vice president. The PDA scandal. He watered down the bank guarantee to an insurance guarantee and changed the requirement of a condition precedent to a condition subsequent. A condition precedent means that meet certain conditions before we hand over ECG to you. He unilaterally decided that they should take the assets and go and look for the guarantee and then turn around and came and told us that they brought him a fraudulent guarantee. Today they are in court, and knowing this government, and knowing their track record, I just pray that we don't have another Ameri, another PDS, and all those scandals following what has happened. And that's all for News Bites on Ghana Talks Radio. Do all to log on to our social for more updates. I'm Deborah Dorso. Thanks for listening. <music>